When it comes to questions about length of day or daylight, the answer lies in the tilts of the Earth. So remember with me that the Earth is at a tilt of about 23.5. This is incredibly important because this is what gives us seasons. It takes a full year for us to circle the sun, right? And during that travel time, the tilt is either away from the sun, like in the winter months, or towards the sun, like in the summer months. So let's focus in on the summer months here. Notice that during the summer, the northern hemisphere is tilted towards the sun. This exposes areas that are further north to longer amounts of sunshine or longer days. In fact, the North Pole, the sun never even sets on the summer solstice because it's tilted so closely to the sun. And we can see this graphically, even in Michigan, if we look at the summer solstice, the first day of summer, and we look at length of daylight, you can see that spots like Marquette pick up 16 hours almost of usable daylight, Traverse City 15 and a half hours, Grand Rapids just about 15 hours and 21 minutes, and then as we go further south, spots like Indianapolis close to 15 hours, but Miami only 13 hours and 45 minutes. Again, that north-south progression is really felt and all has to do with the tilts of the earth. All right, thanks to Ellen. And if you have a weather question that you would like to ask Ellen, all you have to do is email the seven at woodtv.com or you can find Ellen on social media.